Okay, here is today's agenda. I think I'm gonna go get this first. I started off this chapter by going to the nether, finding a fortress in a soul sand valley, and went around murdering every wither skeleton I saw until I got three wither skulls. Oh! Already got the third one, let's go! Then I collected four soul sand, went back to the overworld, and fought the wither in the most non-cheese way possible. Uh, also, there's no game audio because I set the wrong audio output in OBS. And I didn't notice that until like 6 hours into recording, so that's fucking annoying. Anyway, after a hard fought battle against the Wither, I took his nether star, made a beacon with it, and by activating haste too, I could now get a full shulker box of stone in almost a few minutes. Okay, so here are all the necessary items needed for the uh for the cobblestone farm. After acquiring a beacon, I went to work building an automatic stone farm just across the valley from my house. After about an hour or two, it was complete with two stone generators and a TNT duper in the middle that mines the blocks so I don't have to. Now that I had a reliable supply of stone, I set out to build a super smelter. Basically, a large redstone machine that automatically distributes items into a bunch of furnaces, so I don't have to. It was very resource heavy, especially in iron, redstone, and slime balls. The iron didn't really matter though, since my iron farm produced more than 10,000 at this point. But I had to do some caving to get enough redstone to craft the necessary components for the super smelter. Then I spent two nights slaughtering slimes until I had enough slime balls to craft the 48 slime blocks needed for the project. After a lot of back and forth thinking with my thumb up my ass, I decided to build a super smelter in the spawn chunks underneath the iron farm so that in theory, just like the iron farm, the smelter will do its thing even if I'm not in the area. So I started by setting up a haste to beacon for some instant stone mining. Then I dug a giant tunnel 16 blocks wide, 8 blocks tall, and 50 blocks deep to house the massive redstone build. Uh, this super smelter design is based on Il Mango super smelter, except mine uses carpet dupers instead of zero tick bamboo farms to fuel the furnaces. After two and a half hours of boring redstone wiring, the super smelter was complete. Before I could actually use the super smelter, the furnaces had to be fueled up first, so I activated the carpet dupers. While I was waiting for the fueling process to complete, my dumbass finally noticed that OBS wasn't recording my game audio, and so I fixed it. Uh, it only took me six hours to figure that out, so... Alright, carpet dupers are working, and they're really fucking loud. <laughs> My frame rate is tanking a little. You just gotta love duplication glitches, because uh, the, this shit over here saves me so much coal. I love automation. I love automating the shit out of everything. Yeah, I guess we didn't really need all this space over here. Okay, how am I gonna make this look natural? You know what? It's fine. Uh, we'll, we'll just we'll just uh, fucking go with this, I guess. Oh shit! I spawned uh, close to the roof. How convenient. Okay, all right. Okay, I have obsidian and flint and steel, so that I don't get stuck on the roof for all eternity. Okay, so this bedrock here is the one that I need to break. Hmm, let's try this one. Fucking ads, Jesus Christ. Okay, so if this thing works, uh, when I place this piston, when this piston gets destroyed, uh, it should be facing up. Oh! Oh, let's go! It worked! Alright, we 
finally have access to the bedrock roof. We go back in. Okay, perfect. I spawn on the roof. Exactly what I want. Now to finally uh, connect my iron farm and super smelter with my uh, with my main base uh, through nether travel. 2021, okay. Now just break this portal. Perfect! Okay, now my iron farm and super smelter is just one firework rocket away. Oh god, why is everything so loud? Okay, while I'm at it, uh, I should, um, I should link, uh, the end portal. Negative 113236. Oh, fuck, I knew it. I knew there was lava. And... Pearl. Let's go. Alright, if we head through, okay, we go back, excellent, what the fuck, it's a boy with the trident, give me your trident, oh, wow you're tear. ah, oh, no trident, that's, that's sad, alright, full shulker box, oh this forest is ripe for the deforesting, Another full shulker box. This forest uh, gets to live on for now. Okay, uh, I need more oak wood, so... Full shulker box of oak. Uh, as for these saplings... Okay, I think building another trading hall for uh, the other villager professions would be the play here. Gotta get rid of all this uh, disgusting fucking grass. Yeah, this should work. That's the floor done. Okay, do I have enough resources to craft 120 pistons? Oh yeah. And I'm almost out of redstone again, great. Ah, oh, fuck, not even enough redstone. Oh, okay, there's supposed to be holes over here. Okay, so this is where the villagers will be standing. I don't know if I should make one building that's six stories high, or just make two uh, three-story high buildings. Ah, fuck it, I'll just make a skyscraper, I guess. If I'm gonna make this building six blocks high, uh, we gotta make the wall uh, a little more interesting. Fuck it, I'll just worry about it later. Gotta make these strip, because I think that looks nicer. Yeah, that's how you do it. Are you useful in any capacity? Uh, yeah, no you're not. Okay, these are the first two floors done. Uh, all I gotta do now is, uh, transport, uh, 40 villagers. First, I need, uh, I need workstations for the cleric, fletcher, stonemason, farmers, fishermen, butcher, uh, I forgot, weaponsmith, toolsmith, uh, I don't fucking know. Toolsmith, weaponsmith, or armor, uh, I, I don't remember. Shepherds, a leather worker, and cartographer. Okay, clerics will be first. Oh my god, look at all these villagers. Okay, hopefully he stays right there. Yep, I can close that off. And now rinse and repeat 39 more times. Alright, there we go. Oh fuck, uh, uh, d uh. Ah, you're fine. You're, 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 you're totally fine. Oh, what the fuck? If I break this minecart, he can just run free around here, and I cannot allow that. Hey, the sand killed him, not me. Nice. Okay, it should be smooth sailing from here. Beautiful. The very beginning of capitalism. Okay, well, I think we'll go with uh, Stonemason. I thought about killing him, but I guess I'll just wait for him to grow. What? 
zombie in full iron armor. How rare is that? Okay, he's fully grown. Let's go. Do this. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. Stay there. See you. Stay right the fuck there. Perfect. First floor done. Second floor done. Using capitalism to heal my tools. Okay, now I can trade stone with this guy. Oh, look at that. Who needs Enderman XP farms when you have this? I still needed 80 more villagers to complete the supermarket, but there was a shortage in the supply of labor. So I put the project on hold and worked on something else until the supply caught up with the demand. Hey, look at that. My dumbass knows how to use replay mod. Alright, one down, two to go. Alright, another, another one done. There we go. Alright, uh, all three storage houses go- god fucking damn it. Uh, one for cobblestone, one for stone, and one for smooth stone. Now, I wanna automate the process, so... Oh, beautiful. Making sure phantoms don't spawn for at least another hour. Okay, let's build this thing. Yeah, I didn't really do uh, much planning for this project. Uh, I'm just kind of winging it, so this might take me a while. Hello there. Uh, yeah, don't mind me. Yeah, I'll we'll just dig over here. Oh, what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep shooting him. Yes, keep hitting him. There we go. And that's how you avoid getting bad omen. All right, I'm just gotta connect this to that. Okay, that's the pipe system complete. Okay, let's give this a uh, little test run. Do this for stone mode. Oh, it's working perfectly. And it will only go when it has a certain amount of items inside. In this case, cobblestone. That is the stone producing process, completely automated. All right, goes along here into the storage system. Let's uh, try making smooth stone. Flick that lever, all the stone will go here instead up this tube through this second super smelter here where they'll get turned to uh, smooth stone. Now, where would I wanna put the control room? Oh yes, okay. Only one light is on. Yep. If you do this, one light is on. Do this. Oh, it's fucking beautiful. 
nice little indicator of which kind of stone I'm making. Oh uh, yeah, don't don't mind the uh, clusterfuck of redstone I have down here. Yeah, I could have made the redstone wiring a little bit uh, more tidy, but it works. It works, and that's all that matters. And then I guess the lever to turn on the the uh, stone generator itself can go here. And fully I had skulk sensors. Eight. Ten. Okay, we gotta have a little more color with this. Built a nice little house, which will serve as the control room for this entire system. All that's left now is to uh, fill up this massive hole. Making the floor three, three blocks thick, uh, just because I have two shulker boxes full of dirt, and I have no idea what to do with them. Oh god! Oh wow, I'm not only stacked on stone, I'm also really stacked on laborers. Yeah, I'm really hoping that's 80 of them. Beautiful, now you can buy some redstone. I'm gonna need a lot of it. Huh? How'd you get in here? Probably came in from the roof. Okay, we gotta name we gotta name the name tag so I can name the zombies. Perfect. And there's the last villager. Alright, one down, eleven to go. There's number two. Alright, zombie number four. Okay, there we go. God, these zombies are so dumb. Yeah, these zombies aren't really the brightest tools in the shed, but they are useful. Oh, uh, is that naturally spawned or was the or was one of mine? Yeah, I don't think that was mine. 